and welcome to my time at Porsche episode 25 I think we're heading into day 27 or 8 of spring I think we're at now so uh, I'm not sure quite what we're doing Porsche is the part of the Alliance of Free Cities a loose alliance based on shared principles okay and away we go first thing we check is our map chicken run really okay second thing we check is our missions oh boy sewing machine pit stop south block photos i can do the photos yep and the flower shop sign all right so the flower shop sign the photos of porsche we can get done um, i'm really hoping that i have something from the research center soon um, otherwise i'm going to be in a lot of trouble simple claw they sent me some delicate fur thanks guys Let's go help out Emily with the uh, chicken run and then I think what we're going to do is go take our discs down to the research centre and just make sure that I haven't forgotten to um, to give them any discs for the research. Today's episode is going to be a little bit shorter. I'll only do about two days um, worth of play today because, Here they go again. <laughs> they ran off again. because I've got to get I'm a book up. So a marathon or something. You take a Thanks breather. Thanks for your help. These little things had enough fun time. It's time to let them rest. It is indeed. Let me catch the little blighters for you. Come here, trouble. In the box. Goodness me. So this is one of the um, one of the ways you can actually build up your relationship points with Emily. Some um, early on, you get to the point where you get asked to help her catch her chickens, and uh, you'll get some rep points with her that really help out. Sorry to bother you again. Oh, not You're a problem. You're such a nice person. In return, oh. here are some eggs. I really, really appreciate your help. You're welcome. Alrighty. So basically, you get uh, five relationship points with M for that one. And if you go to your social, <clears throat> uh, she is down here. So she, there's a bit you can do. I'm still having a little bit of trouble finding out what her favorite things are. I know she likes topaz. I know she likes chicken earrings, but I don't want to spend half my life uh, at the firing range in um, in the round table just trying to get those up and running. Um, I need to go see what I... Whoops, right through the sprinkler. Don't... Oh, well. It's autumn. It's probably nice and warm. Or it might not be, in which case I'm freezing. Either way, let's check out this flower shop sign and see what we need. Ah, right. Ah, pigments. Pigments can be got from um, carols. They can also be grown. Hey. Hey, how you doing? I get up real early each morning to watch the sunrise. You do, and I have a talisman to help you. How thoughtful of you. With that. I really like it. You're welcome. And say good morning to Nora. Hi, Nora. Hello. <coughs> Minister another one. Lee did not look happy today. Oh, uh -huh, really? He probably had another argument with the people at the research center. The conflict between the church and the research center has been going on for a long time. <laughs> and will they give it a break? We all want the best for humanity. Yep. Thank you. That's pretty much it. All oh, right, it is Saturday. We can also uh, get not a commission, but a guild inspection on and and done. So we'll get that done too. Good morning, Antoine. Hey. How you doing? Uh, it's the season of sadness again. Uh. Old people say beautiful people live a hard life. <laughs> I'll just have to live longer. Well, if you enjoy hardship, sure. Or you can live a good life and not be sad. One of the two. I don't have any soap for him. I'm going to have to go make that. Alrighty. We have one floor here. I need to find three. I can use a magnifying glass for this, but uh, most of the time you don't really need it. Most of the time. This will be one of those days where I'm like, oh, I wish I had a magnifying glass. So if you're new to the game, um, you can turn these things around by right clicking and holding and then just moving the mouse. And it helps you see things you would otherwise miss. And there we go. Back into inspect. Sometimes, like I said, you don't need a magnifying glass half of the time. Just occasionally it'll get tricky.
and you kind of get a feel for it after you've done it a few thousand times. It gets a bit easier. But good, we're getting there. Okay. Flower shop sign, we need pigments. We're going to need pigments to make um, quality leather as well, and we're going to need that a little bit further down the track. So I'm just going to go grab some, a uh, bunch of these pigments. There's two places you can get them. <clears throat> the first is from Carol. Uh, she has, uh, I think, a limited number, but it's, it's actually such a big number, it doesn't matter. So unlike cotton, which she only has 10 of, and uh, I don't need to buy that off her at the moment, She's got 99 pigments. Do I really want to buy 99 of them? No, I don't. I'm going to buy 50. Just to start with. I really need to get those flowers up and going. So the second place you can get them, and I don't think I've got the things I need to exchange on me. No. Right, so the second place you can get them... Do I have my discs on me? Yes, I do. Uh, is from... The church you can actually buy seeds and uh, grow them which is really useful <clears throat> if you're not like me and you remember to actually hello plant them we're still studying the oh. data discs you provided should have something soon awesome oh well, seeing as she's still studying those data discs she can have another data disc Thanks just for your present and i might chat with her as well the people in the church are oh no don't go there Gosh, they are at it hammer and tongs, these guys. I think I've also got a bunch of relics to um, to process, which I will oh. do, but not right now. Strange soup. For that, I need a bat wing, and I'm not sure what else. Probably salt, because it's soup. Thanks. This looks nice. But I think the thing has got about four ingredients. So a bat wing, salt. Oh, those are only guesses. And, um, I don't know, soup has meat in it. Maybe I could try that. And maybe a vegetable. I wonder if I've got any bat wings. Actually, while we're up this end of the world, let's go grab ourselves a couple of bat wings. And we'll see if we can't work out the recipe for strange soup. Um, good morning, Mr. Ladybug. I'm also wondering what my uh, bloodstone supply is like because we've got a ton of rocks up here and I could uh, grab a few bloodstone on the way back. So let's go beat up the uh, poor innocent little panbats. Sorry, panbat. Merlin would like strange soup. Where'd you go? Okay. Did I get... I got a couple of bat wings. Alrighty. Let's go check out that wing supply. Hopefully that's enough because... Oh yeah, well, there's three. Might go up to six. It's only so many times you can ruin soup, right? Alright, let's do some mining while we wait for these things to clear again. So, bloodstone is most... Oops, usually found. In the big stuff. Um, you'll occasionally get it in the small stuff, but you'll usually... It's most often found in the bigger rocks. Uh, you get a bunch of other stuff out of them too. And we need bloodstone for things like power cores and grinding saws. And I'm about to upgrade a bit more of my yard equipment. So uh, I'm going to need some more power, power, stone, uh, power cores. Because a lot of the equipment relies on having a, um industrial furnace. So... Pretty much. Alrighty, let's go with one. And two. Ow. Sorry, little bat. Okay, just one more out of those and we'll be good. Okay. And I could go and get the civil core to get me some bat wings, but I really don't need that many. I don't make a lot of pen bat masks. I probably should. I think there's someone who likes them as a gift. Can't remember who though. That's 
that. All right, that's seven combat wings. That'll do us. So what we're going to do is head back to uh, the workshop and make try and make some bat wing soup. I mean, strange soup. Bat wing soup. What am I on? And now that we have our pigments, we'll also make the sign. That was a good load of bloodstone. Excellent. The the other things you get out of it that you might be interested in are marble and topaz. So marble can come out of pretty much all of the rocks, uh, but bloodstone and topaz tend to come from the bigger rocks. You can get them occasionally in the small ones, but uh, most often in the big ones. should do us. Let's head for home. Tourist? It's a tourist. Okay. You can talk to them. They don't usually have a lot to say. But uh... Oh, actually before we go any further, I forgot. We need a picture of the printing press. And I'm about to miss the Porsche times again. Oh, okay. All right, so to take a picture, you wander in here. Hit Z for your camera once you've got the camera from Merlin. You can right click to reposition. Uh, hit the W key to move past yourself so you're not in the shot. Once the picture has that tick and the blue line around it, you're ready to take the shot. And then just hit space. You get to approve your picture and save it. And that's pretty much it. Hit escape to get out of camera mode. And we're done with our pictures. Now we just have to go find May. <clears throat> so I guess on our way to experimenting with strange soup, uh, we can go and head past. Is that Miss Lucy? That's Miss Lucy. Let's go give her a gift while we're here. Hey Lucy, Hi. how you doing? Holly really is a bright kid. She is indeed. Miss Lucy really loves oh, the crystal I've necklaces. I've always wanted this. Thank you. You're very welcome. And there's Jack. I'm still working out what to give Jack. <coughs> Alrighty, now, oops. Gone straight past the person I need to. There she is. These photos look great! Look for my article <laughs> at the start of next week. Awesome. Alright, and do I have. No, I don't have any uh, jewellery boxes on board. Okay. We'll grab Gust on the way through and feed him some fish soup. Um, hey, how you doing? Leaves in this season. Yes. And I have supper. Here you go. You've chosen wisely this time. You're oh, really welcome. I wonder if I have a, an iron pot on board. No, okay, I haven't got around to making iron pots. I might just have a quick chat with Django. <laughs> Not quite what I wanted to do. Interact. Have you tried your luck in the game corner? Mm -hmm. I handpicked the prizes, so there's bound to be something good to win there. <laughs> uh huh. What do I want to learn today? Um, one you haven't taught me yet. Ooh, lemon. Wait, that's fruit. Let's try Nori. Let's see what he does to us with Nori. Oh. Smart Alec. It's another recipe variation. All right. Now that we have our pigments, let's go make our sign for Alice. That's right. And we were going to work towards upgrading our um. Grab that. Upgrading our workbench as well, and I did write down what I needed for it. It's in my green book, I think. Hmm. 
hardwood planks, bronze bars, and I think that's what I needed. Because of course when I wrote it down I completely forgot to label which list was for which it was for which thing, so I'm in trouble now. Okay, let's go see if we can catch Alice. It is seven o'clock, so I think she's already tucked away in her house and inaccessible to us, so we might just have to do that another day. So Alice lives oh no, she's not tucked away in her house. Awesome. Alice lives here if you're ever ever looking for her. Oh, but there she is. Awesome. We will do this sign with Alice. All done? Yep. Let's design the sign together. Okay. And we do the cutscene. I love this. We get to work on the sign with Alice. There we go. Lovely. I think this new sign is a big step up for the shop. Don't you think? It's a good start. Awesome. Oh, which reminds me, actually. Hi. We should celebrate. Yeah. Do you see anything you like? All my flowers are freshly picked. The flowers are wonderful, but I came to give you a gift. You're really welcome. Alice and Lucy are the two characters who really love the crystal necklaces. I don't think I've given Pinky her fish today. Have I got any fish to give her? Yes, I do. Pinky loves the wise fish. There you go, kitty. And scraps. I haven't found anything he likes better than um, than dog food. I don't think I've got any blade fish on me, no. Alright. I'm going to try him with blade fish. Someone said I should try that. Go, Papa. Okay, and Sonia. Hi! Hey. Watching what trends are in each year is kind of <laughs> like a hobby for me. Oh, now I'm scared about what I wear around you. Here you go. You're you very know me welcome. So well. Okay. So we have done the. That's right. I can see two wishes on my screen. I'm just curious to see who they are and what they want. This one looks like it's Alice, so I might chat with her. Wishes you can get bonus points with. Have you ever visited my garden? Nope. It's not Alice. Who is it? Oh, Sam. I wonder if she wants a waste bag or some kind of food. Sam is right on top of us, literally, because she's up here on the walkway. Hello. Okay, Sam's wish is oh, shrimp and cheese on rice. Goodbye. Which I haven't worked out how to make yet. <clears throat> Doctor Ju. Oh, the closest. Oh, really? Closest I can get for a gift Hello. for Dr. Zhu that he likes is the talisman. Thanks. It looks re It is really special. I like herb gathering. <laughs> but he's not so fond of caterpillars. Poor man. <clears throat> Alright, prepare the building materials for the bus station. That hello Arlo. That would be um now Arlo really likes Hi. I can get him to talk. Fish soup. And it's the spicy fish soup, so the banner fish, ginger, and salt. I like it. You're very nice. You're very welcome. Alrighty, let's talk. I'm flies. It's fall already. The last day of fall is the examination oh. of the miracle flying pigs. As that day gets near, I'm getting more nervous. I need to pull through this. You do. Arlo and Nora. Okay, we are going to try and make this strange soup. Uh, once I sort everything into these bins, that's a bit easier. Alright. Oh, I had bat wings. That's annoying. Going to crafting. Crafting one and two, three. There's my bat wings. Okay. We have bat wings, so we need ingredients. I'm going to try a couple of different things. So I guess, um, I don't know, maybe snake meat. And uh, bamboo papaya. Oops, let's not put that in there. I'm going to put an apple in there as well. Where's the salt? There it is. Okay, and I guess the other thing I want to try is to make the shrimp shrimp on rice. 
I'm just thinking maybe it needs nori. And I haven't got any rice. Alright, well there goes that idea. Yeah. Okay. Cooking. This is this is not good. Okay, let's try. Salt. That wing. Higher. Nope. I don't think that that wing went in. Three. Four. Five. Okay, so maybe Strange Sheep doesn't have that wing in it. Okay, stewed mushrooms, not bad. <laughs> Accidental discoveries. Let's go with eight. And maybe three. And maybe four. Okay, none of that worked. Let's try that again. Three. Four. Eight. E. No, alright. So I think uh, the strange soup is going to remain a bit of a mystery for a bit longer. It's not the first time I've tried to make it, I just can't work it out. Alright. I might look it up in the wiki actually and see what happens. Or the discussion. Uh, I've lost track of what I need to do. So, mission wise, sewing machine, vehicle pit stop, and south block. And I've got that up because it's timed. Alright, I haven't expanded my yard yet either. Is that 90,000 or 80,000 gold now? 90, okay. And, okay, well let's just get this stuff up and running. The good thing about these cutters is that you don't need to be able to have aluminium plate to make it. Just trying to work out, oh yeah. I only need, I can only do eight simply because it's there. Aluminium wire, I think 24 is probably more than enough. Actually, I'm gonna let that run. So I only have one cutter, is that it? Looks like it. Excellent. Pulleys are always good. I'm going to need another crane. Carbon steel bars. You can never have too many of those. You need them for um, steel frames. And you need steel frames for steel shells. <coughs> and basically, uh, carbon steel bars are just essential for it. Alright, we're doing good for glass. I'm just going to let that one run down. And it looks like I'm out of timber again, which is a pain. Okay. Oh, bronze bars. I might get that to make a few more. 137 is not enough. Although it might be now that I've got the new cutters up. So, 19 charcoal. Going to have to make some more of that soon as well. Okay, so what I was doing... Is that my second cutter? Yes. All right. I'm definitely getting some wood. Okay. Fiber cloth. Quality leather. Right. We need some quality leather. That will do. And I'm thinking that you can't have too much. Um, can't have too much fiber cloth. So we've got 436 worn fur. We might as well put that to good use. Okay, so while those stocks are building, let's just quickly check our supplies here. We need salad sauce. Yep. Um, because some of our friends like their salads. But also because once South Block gets up and running, we can take the... Um, Take some trading commissions and we'll need to have a stockpile for that. Let's do a bit more flour because we're going to need that for cooking and for other things. All right with all of that done I think our next most pressing need is going to be uh, chopping. More chopping. So much with the chopping. So we might end this day here and then tomorrow we're going to get into some more commissions. 
need to also check how much composite wood uh, I've got and maybe make another cutter as well another big cutter but what I'm going to save up for is uh, the furnaces because I want to have enough on uh, stock on hand to be able to build those as soon as our see even chopping wood is hazardous in portion there you go Just grab this wood and put it down the hot bar so I can see where I'm up to with it. I need about 500. Well, maybe not 500, 200. Now that we've got a lot of our, our needs moved over to the big burners. Oh, there we go. Alrighty, into day two. And I will make this my last day. Like I said, I've got... Um, got a book I need to finish and I got a bit sick yesterday so I didn't get the words down I wanted to so I need to get quite a few done today alrighty E for check from the Commerce Guild oh, still waiting on these patterns it's driving me crackers all right let's refuel these burners and then we might do something out of the rain uh, I'll just check and see what my yeah we'll just get that as much of that going as we can I'm beginning to think maybe given that I can craft a lot of what I need oh it's going to murder my wood supply Oops. Uh, a lot of what I need can be now built using the raw materials with the new cutters and grinders I don't need to make as many bronze bars as I did so I might just switch that burner over to charcoal because it doesn't seem to matter how many carbon steel bars I have it's it's never enough let that one run through all right I want to check my aluminium supplies So composite wooden board, I need wood. All right, we're going to make a few of those as soon as I get some more supplies in. We're good for aluminium ore. Okay, so I do need another cutter because I need to be making composite wooden boards. What is everyone doing? It's my birthday. Wow, thanks guys. Huh, I wonder what Dr. Zhu wants. Let's go see what he needs. Hey, hey! Recently, everyone is healthy. The work at the clinic is quite relaxed. Oh, excellent! Isn't the workshop builder quite busy? You've been helping us out for quite some time. Is there any way I can help you too? No, it's great. I Want can. It, right? I can handle it. I understand. It. It's okay. You're welcome. All right. I think he's, he's um, I don't know, trying to be friendly. And he's completely thrown my um, thing. Alright, so presents. Once you get to a certain level of relationship with the villagers on your birthday, thank you, whoever that was, uh, they, they give you a bunch of gifts, which is really cool. Um, even if you're like me and completely forget when your birthday is nice. Oh, wow, the cookie master. Oh, I have a spare. I guess I can give the spares to the library. So yeah, so this... Yeah, once your friendship levels get up, so if you have a look at your social... Um, getting gifts from people at, at about your buddy level and not from lower so hmm okay we are going to make ourselves another uh industrial no not industrial what are these things 
comprehensive cutter because we're going to need it to get to keep up with things. So I need, I have one of those in stock. I need to build one of those. I have enough of those and I need, I have enough of those. Alrighty. Steel shells, steel plates, industrial cutter and industrial furnace. So let's go grab ourselves an industrial cutter. Throw it on here. Okay. Grinding saws, carbon steel bars and simple circuits. Make sure I don't have it on me. Steel clay. Ah. Carbon steel bars. And I'm writing badges, chips, and tapes. Simple circuits. Carbon steel bars. Grinding saws. I'm going to need the steel shells for the next thing I build, so I'll grab those while I'm here. Grinding saws. Alright, I have started on my steel frames, that's good. Let's build that. Grinding saw, carbon steel bar, simple circuits. Okay. Grinding saw, carbon steel bar, and simple circuits. So we'll go with the uh, 8 and 7 and 6. Yay! Am I done? We'll retrieve that. Awesome. Oh, look at these guys. Oh, no, don't look at these guys. Okay, that's very sweet. I find it really disconcerting because um, it's not like they're having a party or anything so I didn't expect anything. Industrial furnace, steel shell grinder and steel plate. Okay. Industrial furnace, steel shell, there they are. Industrial furnace, steel shell grinder, and steel plate. Might as well drop that one in there. Dump that one down. Grab this one. And grab that one. And grab that one. It's not a grinder, is it? I just made myself an industrial cutter. That's okay. I can sell that. We'll just uh, stick that in the backpack. <laughs> Except that I don't want to make a comprehensive grinder, will I? I want to make a comprehensive cutter, so we'll retrieve all of that stuff. And um, try and hit the right page this time. I'm glad I caught that before I made it, that would have been annoying. Comprehensive cutter is what we're chasing. Alright. Furnace shell cutter plate. Okay. There we go. Okay, let's try this trick again, but with all the right with the right recipe this time. Okay. So the good news is, is if you mess it up like I just did, you can get all your equipment back uh, simply by. Okay, that won't do. Simply by just retrieving it off the um, the thing. Okay, now we've got that, we can look at getting some timber and we'll get into making these uh, comprehensive wooden boards. Alrighty, so it's 10.53, so I might actually continue just finish the day uh, chopping wood and getting those composite wooden boards up and running. We are bound to need them in the future. I was really hoping that this episode we would finally manage to get that last uh, thing done, but I don't think we're going to get to it. Some 
got a deadline I've got to meet, so I can't, I can't stay, unfortunately. So in two days' time, I'll come back with more uh, our time at Porsche. We will spend a bit of time getting the uh, furnace done once the diagram comes in from the research centre. And then what we'll do is hopefully the story will advance and we'll get a little bit more of the action. I also need to probably go check out Ingalls Mine and clear another layer of that actually. It's only midday, isn't it? It's not even night time. Okay, you know what? Seeing as we're at a bit of a standstill here, we might go and clear another layer of Ingalls Mine. I thought it was midnight. It's not. It's actually midday. So, do it. All right. I need to get some more wood, but I don't need to do that now. If we're going to go clear Ingalls Mine, I'm going to want some health food on board. This last time I went, I didn't take any. Uh, that might have been a mistake. Let's get the ingredients out of the pack. Into the ingredient box. Two and three. And then I think what we'll do... I also need to sell these, don't I? Yep, so all of these, we're going to take them in for sale. Except maybe that I've got to see what I need to put on that. Okay. Let's go back to food and medicine. We're going to need some of that. Let's pop this down in here. Do I have a warhammer yet? No, I've only got a core hammer. Which is equivalent to that. So, alright, so we're going to hang on to our Nova Blade and work our way through with that. And then what we're going to do, aha, small silicon chips. I'm going to put them on me because that way I can actually go buy some flowers. Which I know sounds a bit silly, but uh, they're the flowers you need for pigments, so it'll save us a fortune in the end. Alright, let's get back to preparing to go down Ingalls Mine. Okay, what's that? That's an attack bonus. Stamina, stamina. That's a crit chance bonus. That's a defense bonus. More hit points, always handy. That's a crit chance bonus. I'm just going to stack it up there. Okay. We'll reorder these in just a minute. So basically I'll just toddle over here and grab our uh, mystery meat and put it in there for the minute. Actually, do I have mushrooms? Yeah, just grab that, pop that up there. All right. We are now ready to head down into Ingalls Mine. Uh, what I might do first is just get rid of some of this stuff in my backpack. Do I have bookcases? I have bookcases galore. Okay, so I can sell a few things is what I'm thinking. Okay, let's just do a quick run into ANG construction and we're going to sell some of our excess tools. Uh, I think I put a bunch of them already in the museum, so if I didn't I'll just make some more when I need it. And what we'll do is we'll go confirm that. It's only at 98%, a bit of a uh, disappointment, but that's okay. It will still give us more than what we had. All right, now we've got a goodly bit of space in our backpack. I'm not going to sell him any of those. He's quite happy with that. We must be getting a little bit closer to our 90G. Because we, we really need to upgrade our um, 26. Okay, we're not getting that much closer. We really need to upgrade our assembly assembly thing in me. What's it was that? Hardly thanks. 9,700 gold. Okay. Let's not run to Ingle, Ingle's mine. Let's just grab the DD and head straight over got my weapons, I've got my food, we're pretty good. 
and we'll see if we can't clear that right down to the um, to the bottom because there will be other things for us to clear once we've once we've finished a bit more of the story. Okay, we don't need no stinking elevator. We just need to fly. Here we go. I see your elevator and I raise it by leaping off a cliff. There we are. Alrighty, level two, huh? Let's see how many of these we can get done before I run out of food. What level exactly am I at the moment? Okay, we're sitting on level 41. Okay, cool. Let's go. Oh no, flamethrower boys, they're like rats. Ah, don't hit me with that thing. Talk about crispy critter. Oh man, quit it. You know what, this was so much easier to do with the hammer. <laughs> Pow! Get out of there! <laughs> oh man. I did a run through on this um, last night with one of my other characters and she has the Warhammer which uh, made my life a lot easier. Leading on mine. Flamethrower boy is a pain I tell you. Alright let's do a little bit of a run over here. Oops I'm in a corner that's not good. Oh look, are you still around? Quit it. Okay. So bandages are your friend. I really miss my Warhammer. It does 280 damage. It has no, no crit, but um, the difference, I'm really feeling it. Porsche is a city-state located on the western thing and it's part of Seaside and a bunch of other things. Here we go. All right, note to self, try not to take on more than one at once. Ha ha ha. I just think dodging this guy is not going to work very well for me. I just have to kill him. Oh, is that a little monster? Come here. And the interesting thing is a lot of the guys with the attacks cheat and beggar, come here. With the attacks they um, they tend to pause when you hit them but uh, the flamethrower guy just keeps his finger on the button and uh, then you're in a world of hurt. I'm stuck again. Let's try that trick again. Where am I? It was not this hard before. All right. Oh, what are you doing up here? Get off. Ow. <laughs> That's just a bit mean. All right, so down at the bottom of here, I missed this chest last time. There we go. Hiding in the corner is a chest with a small silicon chip. Let's see if I can actually do this with, oh dear, with a bit less klutziness than last time. I'm not liking my chances here. I got stuck here last time too. All right, and again. Once more for the kitties. Oh, seriously. That's not what I meant by once more for the kitties. Alright, let's go this way. Nope, that's not going to help us. Not sure why I'm getting stuck there. Uh, possibly because I can't drive. But uh, there we go. And we're done with that. keep to the edges it tends to be a little bit better 
Did I actually open up this blue chest? No. Okay. That's right, I was chasing a worm. All right. Oh, really? What are you doing up there? I think I could count myself lucky that I didn't end up falling off the bridge or cutting it out from under myself. Before we go any further, let's grab a little bit of healing. Ow. All right, and down we go. Definitely tougher without the Warhammer. All I can say. <clears throat> okay. Mucus. Alright, you can get that off worms as well. That's good to know. Hey, how are you doing, Bizarro? Alright. Let's take these guys out. One of the other things the Warhammer does that um, that the sword doesn't do, well it does a little bit but not as much, is that it takes on more than one opponent at a time, which really helps in these things. All right. Gotta go this way. Oops. Oh. oh, this feels familiar. All right, let's try again. Got to jump at just the right point, otherwise you get stuck. Oops, nearly went over the edge. <laughs> Seriously, there were no worms up on the uh, thing last time I fought them. I'd like to know how they get there, given they don't have legs. Must be just a series of ramps. They're real good at climbing. Okay, where are we at? I think I missed a chest. Maybe not? No, maybe not. Okay. Okay, what's the health like? Health is good. I'm just gonna go check and see if there's a chest hiding in the corner again. Because there wasn't the last time. Oh, yep, there we go. Nice. Oh, except now that <laughs> now I've gotta go climb everything again. Alright, here we go. Let's see if I can do it without getting stuck this time. Ah. All right. Nope, no shortcutting. Okay. These guys like to do it flying, leap over you. They're insane. Oh, and now there's two of them. Alright, which one was I killing before that one? Alright, who knew? These guys have aluminium ore in their pockets. It's kind of helpful. There we go. Here we go. The abandoned ruin at the bottom of the church tower has many relics and ores left over from the time of whatever it is. Okay. That's right, we can't climb up there. I tried that. Oh, now I really do, do wish I brought my hammer. That thing looks like it needs some panel beating. And I don't think a sword is going to do much to it, but let's give it a shot. Before we go, I reckon we need a little bit of 
a extra weapons hit. Maybe a bit of a crit chance. Definitely some buffing on the defense area. All right, let's go, Piggy. You and me. Oh, maybe if I use my sword, we might be doing better too. Give me back my sword, guys. Thank you. Ah. So here I am trying to hit the number one. It's just not responding. That's a little bit better. Oh, there I go. Yep, this was definitely easier with my Warhammer. All right, I forget where I got it from too. I think it was one of the uh, ruin explorations with the team. And I forgot to buff. Actually, it's not really a good idea to take this thing on from the front. And it's definitely not a good idea to stand there while it's rolling around like a lunatic. Ah, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, wow, this is, this is harder than I remember. Okay, before I go leaping over the edge, though, let's remember to grab, I don't know, maybe a crit chance, because that will help. We don't need to buff our stamina anymore. That's a bit of a defense go. Let's have a shot with that. What's my stamina like? Actually, we might grab a little bit of stamina stuff. Alrighty. Oh, there he goes with the rolling. No, no rolling. <laughs> Where'd you go? There you are. out over here. Oh, nope. I should have been a little bit more cautious on that last run. And away we go again. Next time I'm coming down here with a Warhammer. Nope, 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 no squishing. We're going to play croquet next time. Ah. No, go away. And while I'm here, let's go four. Ah. Aha. Uh -huh. And go one. Ah, no. Ah, get out of here. What are you doing standing there and taking it? Gosh. Okay. And back in with a one. Where'd you go, Pigger? Oh, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> and it stops rolling around like a croquet ball. Did I get it? I got it. Yay. <laughs> that was a lot harder than I recall. Okay. There is a way out. It is... Over here, I am blind. Do I want to get killed on level three? Well, you know what? You only live once, right? Because I am going to get killed on level three. Oh dear. Okay. Especially if I don't look to my hit points before I go in. Alrighty, we've got a defensive bonus. We have not much hit point stuff left. What's that do? Crit chance? Oh, yes, we want that. We're going to eat these. This is when you get attacked when you're not looking, right? All right, royal honey actually helps with your health as well as your stamina, so um, it's kind of useful to keep around. I tend to keep it for presents for Papa Bear, but... Um, I can cut down another tree or three for him. It's all good. 
All right, I am going to just play with my crit chance and defense bonuses this time. I think I learned my lesson from the last run through. Okay, one down. He's probably got... Yeah, there's his friend. No, that's not his friend, but it'll do. Last thing you want is that thing coming up behind you anyway. And this guy coming out from the side is not a welcome sight. Sometimes if you if you manoeuvre right, you can just basically um, get them together. Okay, that's that done. And I'm going in the wrong direction. Typical. I thought there was a chest in here. How do I get to that, I wonder? Now I have to get out of here. It's a little tiny gap, but you can do it. There we go. All right, looks like we've got them all. Every Porsche resident has his or own preferred gifts. Figuring these out can help you build your relationships faster. Yes, it can. Maybe I should grab some health food before I run in here. All right, we are out. We're not going to complete this level, but we're going to give it a good shot. We need, oh no, we need a six and eight, cause, sorry, because our defensive bonus just wore out. And away we go. Getting him before he can jump is the trick, but it's uh, not that easy. And this guy. Gotcha. Oh, that nice monster gave me a band aid. Excellent, where to go? All papers and tiles are available at ANG Construction. You can also purchase the roller thingy me from, I forget, Carol's, I think, or Mars. zappy thing. Can I get to your friend? Yes, I can. Uh-oh, where'd he go? Oh, in there with all his friends. That's not fair, guys. Did we get them? We got them. All right. A slingshot and a fluffy rabbit. Well, no wonder they were fighting so hard. They wanted to keep their bunny. Yes, there is a chest in here. Awesome. Okay, another small silicon chip. We can buy flowers with those, or flower seeds, I should say. All right. In Porsche, a withered branch represents a breakup in a relationship. If you give it to your love interest, they will go away. So uh, if they're not your love interest anymore, that's how you get rid of them. That's a bit mean. Though fair enough. Oh boy. Okay. What have I got on me? I've got an 8 for a defensive bonus. 7 for a crit bonus. Hmm. I'm good for stamina. You know what? I think that's it. This could be interesting. Uh, especially if I go after him with a bowl of fish soup. Haha. <laughs> I 
the hell? Don't just stand there. Nope, that's not working. Yeah, that's it. How about we do a bit of sprinting there, Talina? Oh, no, 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 run. Whoops. <laughs> oh, man, I have been really spoiled with that weapon. Why is she doing the slow... Oh, I've hit the wrong thing. There we go. No. All right, it looks like my auto run has, has auto turned itself off again. Uh, which is a bit of a problem when you're trying to not get killed. Okay, let's go this way. Where'd it go? Ooh, zap! No, no, not good. And again. Oh. So when your auto run turns itself off, you've got to remember to hit your sprint bar, otherwise you're going to be, you know, moving away from your monster and especially placed what is going on here? Oh, my sprint ran out. That's not good. So, yeah, just to make the difficulty a little bit harder, my auto sprint has turned itself off. Uh, I'm trying to turn it back on, but I'm not having a lot of luck. Gosh. All right, let me see what I can do in the uh, in the settings. Um, what's going on? Sound, sensitivity, voice. Oh, no. Graphics, input. Let's try that. Attack, dodge, roll, jump, toggle, walk, and run. Maybe I hit X by mistake. Alrighty. I got my controls. Let's try hitting that. Okay. If your auto run turns off, you've probably hit the X button by mistake. If you hit X, you will end up taking things more leisurely. Hit it again and you can speed yourself up. There you go. Let's remember to buff ourselves this time. We'll go with a bacon fish roll and we'll go with a bit of crit chance. And then we'll go with a one for our Nova Sword, and we'll see if we can't manage to defeat the monster on this round. Maybe not, so, but we'll do our best. Oh, get out of here. Oh no, okay, good. That was a little easier to handle. Okay, so when using your keyboard, don't hit the X button, it makes your life awkward. All right, I think though, I don't know. It didn't, ah, uh, that is clear level three, fine. We cleared level two, which was the pigster, but not level three. All right, let's head for home and see what we got and see if we can get some of this other stuff up and running. Okay. It's really early. I probably could have done another run through, but um, if it's not going to give me the clear, then uh, there's not much point. Well, unless you're after more, more good stuff. But I'm also out of hit point materials, which makes life hard. Harder. Okay. So Engel's mine is pretty hard to clear um, without the Warhammer, but with the Warhammer it becomes a lot easier. So um, that, that was a bit educational. What do I need? I don't really need aluminium, so there's no real excuse to go into the aluminium mines. For head. All right, we'll head for home and see what uh, actual actual ores we need. I have a funny feeling we definitely need timber, uh, but we also we also may need iron and uh, copper so I'm going to have a quick check on those before I do anything and then we'll see because most of my I just took it to the wrong DD stop didn't I you know what while we're here let's go get some timber we might as well just you know instead of having to duck in and out grab that one
Once we get the factory, our tree chopping time is going to go down by a lot because we're going to be able to fuel everything um, in the without having to use timber. We'll be able to use our power cubes instead. So it's pretty much uh, the same reason why you would get the flooring, the conductive flooring, because you would be able to uh, not have to chop so much trees. So many trees, I'll get there eventually. Oh, that was close. Playing chicken with the sea urchins. I think they're playing chicken with me though. Okay, now I'm playing chicken with them. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Poor little sea urchin. Grab that one. Pop that through. Alright. I know we've got crystal trees, but it's always good to grab the, the extra crystals while you can. No, I don't want to have a fight, Mr. Snowlock, and I'm not in the mood to play. Let's see, go eat your grass. Let's see. Awesome. The wildlife makes it really hard to not kill them. Get this one done. Take out one, take out two, take out three. Yay! Can't take out the apple tree. can take out the big rock. We might get a little bit of um, bloodstone from here, but the island's not... Even the big rocks on the island don't tend to yield a lot of it. That one gave me some. Okay. And that one gave me some as well. Let's make a liar out of me now. I tend to find I don't get as much bloodstone off the island as I do out of the um, collapsed wasteland. Oh, there we go and that's where I'm going to leave it today guys thanks for hanging with me uh, we'll have my time at Porsche back in two days time and tomorrow we're going to do some pumpkin days so take care out there and I look forward to spending a bit of time with you in a couple of days time